get dirty. You like it a lot. It sounds like dirty talk. That's really gross. You're gross. <laughs> Do they look beautiful? How do you feel about these luscious lips? I don't know why stuff is more. <laughs> Ow! Honey! You took my nose contour with you! <laughs> is my nose still there? Is it still high? Is she still looking at the high heaven saying hi to Jesus? No, she's not. You ruined me. God! I'm morning, my loves. Welcome back to today's vlog bit. I don't know if you guys can tell by the title of today's video, but it is literally about to be an utter shit show. And let me tell you why. I have tried for so many times to film this intro correctly. And it has been so difficult, mainly because today's entire video is going to be revolved around my dogs and they are not cooperating. My dogs are going to be deciding what I do for the next 24 hours. These little puffers right here. Just this one, this one, this one. <laughs> oh my god, he just burped in my face. If you guys don't know, this is my little Frenchie tiger. I also have another tiger. Or I, also have to have I also have another Frenchie by the name of Mango, and she's gonna be helping me decide what I do today. I'm just gonna get started. I need to change. And this is how we're gonna play the game. So essentially, everything that I do, I've written down on four little like note cards. <gasps> Mango, thank you for joining us with your present. Thank you for doing this free charity work for my channel. I know you're booked and busy, Mango. I get it. I've got four sheets of paper and they say things like, so this is the first round. This is gonna be the round where they choose what I wear today. And this one says, Insta baddie outfit. Mm. So that means I just have to wear like a crazy Insta hoey. Shop this Fashion Nova look outfit, you know? And then the next one is pajamas. <laughs> and then whatever Stefiance is wearing. Oh shit. Yeah, hair and all. He's super hairy oh, too right gosh. now. He's wearing a black t-shirt and giving Tiger his hair back. That <laughs> is on his shirt. So I would have to wear exactly what you're wearing. Like yeah. those clothes. And then the last one is going to be a completely rainbow outfit. I'm just going to try to wear as much color, as much rainbow. What's your favorite? Probably pajamas. Pajamas? Yeah. So we're going to put a little piece of kibble in front of each of these and the dogs are going to come into the room and the first kibble they eat. I'm going to put a kibble in front of each Why do I feel like I'm on like a game show? Okay, I'm going to show you guys this. Uh, where are you going? Where are you going? Hello, where are you going? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. She's coming. Oh my god, she's coming. Oh, okay. <laughs> this one. So, let's see what this one is. Which one do you think this one is? This one, where are my clothes? It's gotta be my clothes. It's an all rainbow outfit! Oh, okay. I like that one too. You did me dirty, Mango. You did me dirty! You don't want me to be comfortable today! with Scentbird. Thank you Scentbird for sponsoring today's video. I'm super excited because I don't know if you guys remember. Oh my god, if you are an OG, you will remember this. It's been like, it's been like a year. A year. So you guys know. I love me some Scentbird. So if you guys don't know, Scentbird is a monthly subscription service. Essentially the way that it works is you pay $15 a month and you get to try a 30 day supply of designer perfume. They don't send you just like regular perfumes. They send you very specific, very amazing designer perfumes, which is insane because each like supply that they send you for 30 days there's about 120 to 130 sprays in each little 30 day supply which is a ton of sprays I never need that many sprays and for me I use it in a different way like this is a really really good way to like dip your feet into the door like if you're like hey I do want to try designer perfumes but I don't have the money to spend hundreds of dollars on like I don't even know how many ounces like the tiny little bottles so on top of that I know a lot of people who just like to smell differently on different feelings and vibes and outfits I pick these out so this is how cool like their packaging is because it doesn't spray like a lot of the trial sizes they always have like that cap that you got to keep track of if you lose the cap which I always lose the cap but this one just nothing you don't you don't spray when it's down and then you can actually take it out so this one is the fresh oh, grapefruit but I have the hand lotion to this one and I just really wanted the perfume you guys know I love fresh perfumes too look at how big this is this is a big vial the Gucci guilty mm -hmm. that's a good scent Ooh, she guilty or whatever. So like I said, these are 
perfect if you get sick of the scents easily. You don't want to spend $100 on one scent and just be tied to that. They work with like massive designers like Tom Ford, Glossier, Nest, Gucci, all of these. And then also you can just like interchange these. So I like to put them in the, like they didn't come in these colors. I actually interchanged them because I feel like that rich scent was more of like a pink. And then Gucci Guilty, you know Gucci's red, so I put it in the red one. Take it, come here. Good boy. Oh. Oh, Mango, you're a little late. Mango's late <laughs> to the party. That's it? That's it? That's my commercial. Oh, the puzzle. Look into the mirror right now. <laughs> Loser. It's been a long day. Guys. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see, but it's a bit dark outside. Let me explain. So I woke up this morning feeling like a gracious dog owner, feeling like the best doggy mommy. Frenchies, no big deal. Et bonjour, I'm the best, right? That's literally how I woke up. And then all of a sudden, I... St Oh my god, I thought I felt another one. I thought I felt another one. I was about to pass out. I decided to just walk across the room and unknowingly, unbeknownst to me, the one time that I forget to put on my pink house slippers, never again, I step on a fat, juicy... Dingleberry. <laughs> and it was Dingle Bells. And if you don't have a dog, then you don't know this theme song, but it's Dingle Bells, Dingle Bells. Wow, that's not fun. And so I get into the shower and I just get the shower head and I'm just like washing the little poops off my feet and then I decide to let go of it and just straight to the face. I got sucker punched with a stream of water and I tried to kind of pat it dry and like tried to do all of that but I just had to take off all of my makeup and redo it and do some of my hair all over again. If you see me looking a little bit busted the rest of the video, just know it wasn't my fault. It was all Mango's fault. But like here we are about to give Mango an expensive ass toy. Some time. Oh! We've been looking at this toy for quite some time. It was a big investment that I wasn't sure that I wanted to make, but we decided to finally pull the trigger because Mango's a monster. She's a beast. She beats up any toy that's not like solid rubber. A lot I don't of think solid this one rubber last, toys. <gasps> don't say that. Hashtag not spots. But this is like called the Wicked Bone. Apparently, it runs around. And we were thinking about getting her like one of those ball throwers where the dogs like stick it in, and then the ball thrower shoots out the balls. And I'm like, that sounds like Tinder, but it's not. It's for dogs, right? But then the problem is, I don't think she's smart enough to put the ball back in there. And second of all, what if it just like hits a mirror or hits me in the face? Like, I don't know. I don't want balls just flying around in the house. I mean, I already have two flying around and that's enough for me, sis. Did you get that one? Two balls flying around. <laughs> Apparently you can control it with your app or whatever. Mango, you don't even, you don't even look excited. Okay, I guess you kind of look excited. Leave it in the comments what kind of dog is your dog if you guys have a dog. So I, I heard from like a dog trainer there's a couple different types of dogs. It's like your love language for humans but for dogs. So there's like toy driven dogs and you try to teach them how to do things by encouraging them by giving them time with toys or new toys. There's treat driven dogs which is like food. People who like dogs that will do anything for a treat like sit, paw, bark, blah, 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 right? And then there's people driven dogs that just like want love. So what type of dog are you? Honey! Oh my god, that's so fancy. Oh! Yeah, this looks inappropriate. This is fancy. Oh shit, what is this? Dog oh, toy. Okay, wait, oh you have to gosh. download the app. You have to download. Hold on, where She's is the manual? Wait till we connected it and my fiance's oh freaking out. You're not ready for okay, this. Okay, we're not ready? ready. We're ready. Okay, so you put it down. What's happening? Whoa, it's moving! It's moving, Mango! I don't think Mango she, doesn't like it. She's she's scared. She's scared. <laughs> she's scared. Look, look, this is called bachelor. Oh, 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 she don't like that. Whoa! <laughs> he has no interest. She's literally flipping over shoes. Bro, it's not that serious, Mango. <laughs> oh, how cute. Okay, make it stay still so she can like kind of familiarize. Yeah. yeah. And then we'll make it move. Ready? Yeah. Smart. Wow, she's aggressive. She's dominating. Guys. Yeah, she really is. You know what they say technology is smarter, but is it smarter than Mango? I didn't think so. Do you have any gear? Oh. 
She doesn't like it. She doesn't like it moving like that. Oh my god, she doesn't like it moving. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh my god, she's getting so mad. She's getting mad. <laughs> This can be really misconstrued as an inappropriate toy that just fell on the ground in a bedroom or something. <laughs> 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 Woo! Oh my gosh, it's that baby! Did you have a good time? You need a mini break! It's so bad, Mango's so obsessed with toys that we actually have to physically remove the toy from her vicinity so that she can calm down. Like, if it weren't up to us, I feel like she would literally die playing with these toys. And now we have to decide what they're doing today. What do you want to do, Mango? We're just trying to get Mango to calm down, so I think I might have Tiger pick the activity of the day because... I did feel like a little busted, no? We have four different little note cards that they're gonna choose from, and the first one is wash the dogs. They're not gonna enjoy that one. So we have two that they're I'm gonna really gonna love. Enjoy that one. Yeah. Okay, the second one is go to the health spot, which is like this cute little dog store. I think that one will be fun, right? And then the third one is <laughs> DIY dog it clothes. You guys know we've done that before, so <laughs> I think that one would be fun, right? And then the last one is go to the doggy park. And so when we say the doggy park, the downtown dog park is actually a little bit dangerous or like the one closest to downtown. So we do have like on the amenities floor, there is like a little doggy run. Um, that's what they call it. Even mango, it's the craziest thing because like anywhere there's grass, like mango typically loves it. And so we're like, this is perfect. I mean, it's secure. It's inside the building and like we should be fine. And so when we take her, I don't know why mango thinks she's clean because she like doesn't want to step on the grass because it smells like pee and so it's a little bit weird I guess dogs know when it's not their pee so those are gonna be our four options for activities if we do end up going to the healthy spot we actually have like another thing like I'm gonna do like a budget of like the day with like the little note cards and stuff so we'll see what they choose I'm gonna line these up and I think we're gonna get tie tie I feel like they're gonna Tiger. pick the I feel like they're gonna pick the DIY dog clothes I feel what like we're what do want them to pick? wash the dogs wash the dogs <laughs> Honey, you don't even wash the dogs. But I have to this time. Hey, you know I read this DIY though? What? That if you put some peanut butter on the side of your bathtub, yeah. they'll be so busy licking it that they'll be still. That's really gross. You're gross. <laughs> <laughs> peanut butter on the side of the bathtub? It just looks wrong. Oh, ew, yeah. Oh no, the Kraken's already smelling Ready? it. Okay, he covered his eyes, and so you can't see his eyes, but I see his nose like... Doing 360 <laughs> turns right now. Okay, okay ready? ready? Release them. Two, one, go. Tiger, come here. Oh. 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 oh, oh in oh, a oh, line. Oh. What do you think it is, honey? Wash the dog. Really? <laughs> Bits. Really? We're washing the dogs. Oh shit, honey. I don't think uh, we like this. What do you mean? I don't think a dog recognizes you anymore. Yes, I do. Yeah. If you ask me on a new first date, I show up like this. Baby. I go, oh, Teddy, no problem, but it's your beat. You like it? Mango? <laughs> okay, let's do it. Okay, so hop in, wash the dogs. This is a supervisor look. Mango, let's go. Here. All right, bye, guys. I'm just going to turn on the no, water. No, no, no. Mango, are you plotting a prison break right now? He okay, looks like go, go. What are you doing? Go. What huh? are you doing? I'm not washing them. You better wash them. I'm not washing them. <laughs> I'm not washing them. This is our first on bike camera. This is not my job. This is your job. Honey? Okay, let's go. Okay, let's go. Oh yeah, Tiger. Oh yeah, you like it. You like it a lot. Oh yeah, let's get it. Let's get dirty. Okay, if let's anyone uses the audio of this, what? I will love you forever. <laughs> Please, you're just becoming a meme, honey. What is it? If someone just uses the audio, what does it sound like to you? It sounds like dirty talk. I mean, I guess they are dirty. What kind of dirty talk is that? It's like 16 year old boys. Like, oh, this is dirty talk. Okay. Wow, how dirty! Okay. I'm sorry, Mingo. I'm sorry you had to see that. Oh, come here. I wish I could help you. I wish I could uh, take you, you out of your misery. I wish you could help me, man.
They're officially ready. She's ready. I don't know why she acts like. Oh gosh. Where is she hopping to now? He's so cute that he just kind of like lets us do our thing. And she's so mad at me. Good girl. Did you Good give them boy. one kibble of their regular food? Yes. Sir. But they literally act like that's the best thing ever. Look at him. You love that? <laughs> so, I just realized something. Um, I was gonna do like a dog decides what I eat for dinner, dog decides what I do for my skincare routine, dog decides what I wear to sleep. It was gonna be real cute. She was gonna do the most with it. She was gonna do the absolute freaking most. Mango and tiger were gonna decide my life away all throughout the night. Well then, I don't know what happened, but I'm actually going to Atlanta before I go to Paris. So, but then I'm like going straight to Paris from Atlanta. Also, this sentence is so annoying. I don't know why every time I say Paris, I cringe and like, mm. I'm going to buddy. And so I'm going straight to Atlanta and then straight to Paris from Atlanta. And I don't know why in my little pea brain, I thought I was leaving for Atlanta tomorrow night in the middle of the night, but it's actually in two hours. Good job. But that was your fault since you booked the tickets. We gotta go. We gotta go. I'm so we stressed go out. Pack. Yeah, we're gonna go pack. I don't know what I'm wearing to Paris. I don't know what I'm bringing to Atlanta. I don't know anything. I have literally two hours to shower, to redo my makeup, to pack everything, to pack all my lights, my camera gear, all of that bullshit. You know, I don't even know where our passports are. That was on my list to do tomorrow morning. So we're not going to Paris. <laughs> no, fuck you. So stay tuned for tomorrow's vlog because I'm literally gonna pack my entire life away in two hours this is literally the video people watch and they're like i told you all youtubers are idiots <laughs> so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video i know it was a little bit shit day or whatever but i just really couldn't like i just did there's no way to end this without like literally missing my flight to atlanta so i love you guys so so much and i'll see you guys tomorrow oh.